Hi, this is Shri Ayer. I'm a certified healthcare professional. And today our discussion is about five ways that we can supplement our diet to ensure that it's a well-balanced diet and that we derive all our nutritional needs from it. So topping our list is uh, protein supplements. Uh, protein, as we all know, is very essential for muscle repair and growth. However, if you do not eat dairy or meat, then you might not have adequate protein in your diet. Um, so one of the ways to supplement is to use protein supplements. Um, you have vegan options ranging from hemp, rice or pea protein and proteins derived from these sources can be used to add into your smoothies or have it um, as protein bars. Uh, another option is whey protein. Whey protein is derived primarily from dairy and it's a highly absorbable and digestible source of protein. So especially if you have difficulties with the uh, digestion of uh, other types of protein, then whey protein is a good option for you. Um, also protein, as you know, keeps you satiated for longer. However, if uh, you suffer from lactose intolerance or any dairy related allergies, then whey protein might not be an ideal choice for you. The next on the list are multivitamins. Multivitamins um, can be effectively used to supplement your diet and to ensure that you are able to absorb the maximum from your uh, dietary intake. Whenever you choose a multivitamin, be sure to, uh, to, to have that it has vitamin A, C, D, E and K as well as calcium, magnesium and zinc. The next on the list are uh, probiotics. Probiotics are essentially uh, good bacteria that thrive in your gut and promote digestive health. Uh, when you have probiotics, make sure that it has um, a variety of probiotic strains and uh, be sure to consume it with your um, meals so that uh, it will help the bacteria to survive the digestive acids which are uh, produced in your stomach. Uh, next are omega-3 fatty acids. So omega-3 uh, fatty acids are essential to for heart health, um, to reduce inflammation as well as to uh, boost good immune function. Um, omega-3 fatty acids are derived from um, uh, fatty fish such as salmon uh, or from vegan options such as flaxseed oil. Uh, when you choose omega-3 fatty acids, make, be sure that um, the omega-3 fatty acids uh, has a combination of both EPA and DHA uh, which are the most important type of omega-3s. Last but not the least is definitely vitamin D. Vitamin D is an important um, hormone that uh, works uh, on um, bone health and as a mood regulator. So uh, if you are exposed to sunlight, your uh, skin can produce vitamin D. However, if you don't get enough of sun, then uh, you tend to be deficient in vitamin D. Um, to conclude, uh, these different types of supplements to your um, daily diet can definitely help to make sure that you are um, having a well-balanced diet as well as uh, deriving all the nutritional needs uh, your body needs to function effectively. However, as I always say, do consult your healthcare provider before embarking on any type of supplementation. Thank you for watching. Bye.